All right, guys, what's going on? RTD here, bringing you another video. And I would just like to say, I uh, hope you guys have a wonderful weekend. And while I was at work, I uh, came across this topic that uh, I want to talk to you guys about. And what it is, is being grateful of what you have. And I was talking to one of my colleagues, and you know, like the whole time, dude, uh, this guy's a brand new guy. And he was just talking about, oh man, dude, like, he sounded so negative. And all he was, was, was complaining about not having things that, um, I guess, that you don't need. You know, he was complaining about, oh man, I wish I have a better car. Or I wish I have a bigger house. Or I wish I have a better clothes. I wish I have a big, making more money. You know, like, I wish I have bigger TV. You know, like, it's just made me think that. You know, like, this guy was saying stuff, you know, like, Oh, I have all of this, but it's not good enough. Yet, I'm thinking to myself that I'm pretty sure a lot of people wishes that they got what this guy have. And what I'm trying to come across to is, I guess people take for granted of what they have. And always want better things. Not necessarily to better their lives or... To make themselves better but they just want materialistic things uh, they want to I guess show off or make other people think that oh man this guy is you know awesome he has the newest car the biggest TV or you know the newest console game you know they don't really appreciate the fact that you know they have a roof over the head they eat three five six seven meals a day you know they're allowed to themselves to eat whatever they want basically you know have nice things internet phone clothes all this stuff that we take for granted but don't realize that we have it good than most other people I mean I remember growing up in the Philippines and you know like just living basically at, at a farm you know we grow not grow, but raise our own pigs, you know, grow our own crops. We didn't have any, like electricity, we used candles. I remember that when I was a kid. We didn't have any internet, you know, we didn't have any TV. And I remember like, just this, the, the life back then was simple. And you know, like we appreciated the family just getting together during dinner time, lunch time, just talking, you know, doing our chores. And you just appreciate little things. And when I move here in America, you know, like we have all this distraction. We have TV, we have Facebook, we have internet, we have, you know, all kinds of stuff. And we are constantly bombarded with ads about, hey, check out our new stuff. Hey, try the new things. Oh, yeah, you just got this new phone? Well, guess what? We have a better one. And I don't know, it just, people just... I don't know like they want stuff that doesn't really matter uh, they just want they just want it for the sake of having it and you know like they base their life around that just wanting more and more and more and more and to the point that I don't know I guess they lose sight of the grandier thing uh, you know, they get sad, they get depressed because, man, I only have the iPhone 5, but, you know, like, damn, that sucks. My friend got the iPhone 6, you know, like, it's just, to me, it's just so stupid, but I guess I just don't see the point of it, you know, like, just be, I guess, I mean, the, to wrap it up, I guess, just be grateful of what you have and don't base your life around stuff that doesn't really matter like mat material stuff so yeah i don't know i was helping just like rambling and all that good stuff but i guess you get the point of it so yeah that's all i got for today i'm out here guys peace out
over. This is the work of God. <laughs> 